Well, market watchers expect aircraft leasing companies to see strong business this year. This will be driven by airlines finding it difficult to pay for aircraft orders made in better times. There are also concerns that overcapacity will see more carriers going bust this year, with mature markets bearing the brunt. There could be some turbulence ahead of global airlines. Industry watchers say there could be more planes being added to the market than passenger demand can catch up, putting pressure on yields and margins. And with some carriers being cautious about their finances, money may be hard to come by to fund plane orders made in better times. Some observers believe this will result in more sale and leaseback activities in the airline space this year. When times were good, when uh, there was business was strong, airlines were taking on a lot of aircraft. But once the economic crisis hit, there were a lot of aircraft, uh, airlines were unable to take these aircraft on. So what's happened is that they're looking to cut costs. Leasing companies come in there. Aircraft lessors like BOC Aviation are eyeing the opportunity to meet demand and competition. It's hoping to grow its fleet by 20% this year after taking delivery of 48 aircraft last year. We're going to see new players in our industry emerging, a combination of new entrants and existing players. Uh, we have some significantly sized existing players who are opening up their balance sheets again. Um, and we're beginning to see new um, private equity firms beginning to come into the market and want to commit equity. Some analysts are concerned that overcapacity will see more airlines going bust. Against the background of what seems to be uh, a relatively weak revenue environment, putting more capacity in will further depress uh, yields and depress revenues. However, it's going to be market by market. All markets are a challenge. If you're in a mature market uh, and there's the risk of another sort of leg to the economic downturn. Some industry players believe that overcapacity will peak in March and will take some time to clear.